David Wowie from Another Eden Adventures and I have a Japan spoiler for you! Japan has just announced a brand new unit and before I get into the details, let me show you that trailer and wait until the end man, I hope it's not meant to be sad because I found the sound hilarious. Here it is. ネゲバもない。出口もない。俺の一生は檻に捕らわれたままなんだ。さまよえる少女と久遠の渦。回る定めと行幸の檻。ぶっ壊してやるよ。全部全部全部全部全部全部。全部全部全部全部。this bloke's name is Yakumo, and thanks to the great translators of Reddit and Discord for this info, apparently Yakumo is a KMS employee who works late at night. He's not good at socializing and basically goes home and sleeps when not working. He works hard to improve his department, but is resentful of the environment and people around him. He calls his life a normal day that sucks. He hates his job and feels underappreciated and hates his colleagues. That is pretty much everyone who is working in an office right now. Zenbu, 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 Zenbu! Yakumo is part of the future timeline and looks like he may be the last character to be unlocked for the Apocrypha series, but I hope not because I really want a Nona AS. He is a Shade Staff user with low HP but high MP. His sidekick, and if I'm reading the katakana right, is Kiyomos, or depending on the translations you read online, Kiyomos, or Kimos, or Kaimos, and it is a KMS mascot. It restores everyone's MP by 10% and Yakumo's by 20% and puts Yakumo in a mana state where he doesn't consume MP. How freaky does this mascot look? I won't get into details of Yakumo's skill set just yet until closer to his release, but what do you think of this upcoming unit? Where does he rate in your Husbando tier list so far? Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you in the next video. Much love. <笑>終わりだ。消し止め。手間のかかる仕事だった。さまよえる少女と久遠の渦、回る定めと行幸の檻。穴沢エデン、時空を超える猫。<笑>